Hi, my name is Belgica and I'm an actress based out of California and I make acting related videos every Monday, Thursday, and Saturday. And like you, I know about Joseph Perlman and I know that he is an acting coach. Um, you have probably seen him a lot on the backstage channel as have I. He's done so many lives throughout 2020 and even in 2021 he's done some videos with backstage so I have seen him so many times. He always talks about audit my class, audit my class and finally I audited the class and I wanted to tell you guys what I thought about it in case you're also thinking about auditing it or um, you know joining the class. I did just audit the class one time. I did the Wednesday one which was from 12 to 3 30 and I'm going to tell you how I went and my thoughts about it. Of course I got a small small glimpse of the acting you know session um, because I only audited one class and I'm going to tell you if I plan on taking more what are my thoughts about it and um, the pricing first of all is higher than other acting um, courses that I have seen and I understand because you know once you have a certain level a certain status you can charge more so um, you guys can of course check out his website I'll link all his stuff uh, in the description so you can check it out not sponsored he doesn't even know I'm doing this um, I in my channel I like to share with you guys things that I'm learning things that I'm doing and I am genuinely interested in taking more of his classes and was genuinely interested in auditing this class so that's why I'm sharing it with you today because I'm interested the class started with just saying hi to everybody this one is on zoom I don't know if that's going to change anytime soon I'm assuming not because he has a lot of people from all over the world um somebody there at the towards the end of the class she said it was like midnight where she was and for us it was like three o'clock 3 30 so people from all over the world and there were a few other people auditing as well so at the beginning of the class he just waits a few minutes of course once you get on zoom he waits a few minutes to allow people to come in say says hi to people um and if you are auditing you can also have your camera on there were some people that turned their camera on and off that were auditors or students in the class but um if you're wondering, hmm, am I gonna turn on your camera? You should, you should say hello. Um, and that's exactly what happened in the beginning. He said, if anybody's auditing, feel free to say hello, introduce yourself. Um, and because of course my name isn't so common, I had to say my name um, a couple of times and just, you know, say hi and then the auditors just, they don't participate, um, but they do have opportunities towards the end to do a Q and A session. So, after we said hello, then he opened it up for people to um, talk about, you know, wins, risks they did, um, things they got cast in, and then they got to share like, you know, oh, the scene I was working on last week, I actually got cast in it because some people bring um, things to work on to class that are for actual auditions. So we'll get there though. So at the beginning, introductions, if you're an auditor, you will introduce yourself. Everybody says their wins, not the auditors, but the people in the classes. And during the intros, when people were, you know, sharing like, oh, I got, I booked this, or I, um, you know, I got this win, or I took this risk, I sent this email, whatever, they would also ask Joseph some questions. And some of them were also about the industry. They weren't purely about um, acting technique you know uh, later on we definitely got into more acting technique and practice but at the beginning it was a lot of industry stuff so if you guys have seen his lives with backstage you've probably seen that he talks a lot about the industry and the craft this is a great opportunity to ask him your specific questions and you know learn more about the industry of what's going on with you specifically because acting is such like there are certain things you can do to you know level up your acting and i'm learning this right now um because right now i'm really trying to get a theatrical agent in la so i can do some co-star roles but um there's so many things that you know oh this is the way sorta kinda <laughs> and then you have to figure out how to actually do it for your specific case so um it was really cool to be able to have somebody that's so knowledgeable answer your specific questions after the intros there was a little warm-up so joseph picked a person and then it was kind of like popcorn where it, when you were going you got to choose who went out and then you came in so they did a little warm-up of improv warm-up and then they got to uh rehearsal or you know playing around with some text that they had prepared and some of it was things that they were actually auditioning for so i'm not going to explain exactly what it was because of course this is paid you should pay for it if you want to do it but throughout most of the course um most of the audit that i did uh 
Joseph chose uh, one of the students and the student had already had prepared some sides like they had brought some sides to work on during the session and um something that i really appreciate it, <laughs> appreciate about joseph is the the care like how much he's really really listening to each student and how honest he is to everybody and if they hit something really well he's like wow did you feel that you know did you did this really well and then when they're not quite there he asks different questions and assists them to get Get to that place you know to be able to um perform that as at its as at its fullest capacity so i really appreciated that there were some very very talented actors in that course and it was just really fun to see them play with this text so whenever for example he chooses you you can say okay i have these sides i'm this is for an actual project um this is for you know um a TV show or a streaming network series that I'm auditioning for. So that's the style. And um, then they go for it and they do choose a partner to do the other side if there's other people in that scene. So um, the other person, of course, would be the reader and it is somebody in that class. And um, if you do have any NDA scripts and you really don't, you know, don't trust anybody yet in your class, you can also ask Joseph himself to read the um, the other lines. So, you know, because sometimes you get NDA scripts and you just are so scared to share them with anybody, um, you can share them with him and then, you know, you, you will feel comfortable that they're not going to share them. But in general, I feel like most actors aren't going to go around and distribute uh, scripts especially in a place like this in an acting class where it's supposed to be a safe space where you know you're building relationships and trust within these classes I would hope so hope that nobody would share your sides pretty much everybody that was in the class did uh, get to go get to rehearse something I, I know there's different tiers so I'm not sure if the people that didn't go it was because they were either auditors or in a different tier but in general i really enjoyed this class because i got to see how other actors work and i love seeing other actors auditions audition and act because i learn a lot from you know what they're doing and i'm like oh i'm making that mistake too and i really see what it looks like you know when somebody else is doing it because sometimes it's hard to see it when you're doing it i really love seeing actors work and especially the way that joseph is giving them feedback and you know instructing them to to find really what's in that text i'm not going to take this class right now just because this specific class to me auditing it one time i saw that it is a lot of rehearsal and working on you know playing around with um improv and your text and things like that and i do want more um specific training and acting and specifically meisner i want to do more meisner training so although in acting classes you will still work on some text i want to focus right now more on the um you know the technique of acting rather than practicing text um but i do definitely want to take this class in the future and be able to play around with text and have joseph give me feedback in the future once i'm ready for that i just feel like right now i'm getting a lot of commercial work and i'm not getting as many um like scripted you know auditions and um, as many opportunities to play around with that text so i know it would be more beneficial for me if i did it later on in the year but i definitely enjoyed it he's such a sweet honest person and there's a lot of different kinds of acting teachers some people will not give you very much feedback and that's something that i don't really like some people will give you positive feedback like will give it to you in a very nice nice way which is the way he does it and then there's some people that give it to you in an honest way that sometimes can be rough and dirty you know and I appreciate that too I appreciate both ways of like this is how it is you're not giving it all to me like what are you doing here you're not giving it all to me so um I appreciate a lot of different kinds of styles of acting um coaches but um that's why I'm not going to take it right now because I don't have enough things to work on when the scripted side so for this class um it got down to 3 45 and we were actually still going but unfortunately i had to leave by 3 45 because i had another appointment um after the class so just a heads up it might take a little bit longer than the 3 30 so i know there was going to be a q a after the uh you know after everybody got done working on their scene or monologue or whatever it was because somebody did also work on a monologue um but i didn't get to stay for that but um 
I know he was going to, you know, be as awesome and kind as he was throughout the whole class. Yeah, I had to leave early, unfortunately, but I really enjoyed it regardless. I think it's a great way to practice your craft and to see how other actors work and to get some feedback from Joseph. So I would recommend auditing the class if it's something that you're interested in, it's something that you can afford. I definitely, definitely recommend it. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go ahead and... Um, feature Joseph Perlman's YouTube channel right here in case you guys want to check him out. Links in the description for everything else at the end of every video I feature another channel. Today is it's Joseph. Um, thank you so much for watching and if you would like to be featured on my next video make sure you're subscribed, like this video, and leave me a comment.